let's get a little crazy, because gaming should be fun. Hey, 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 this is Miss Valley Gaming. My name is Dread, and the game is Conan Exile. Welcome, gentle worms and snagglepusses. Welcome, one and all. Welcome to new subscribers. Welcome to those who've been here from day one. Welcome. Don't forget to uh, leave a like, uh, a like and a thumbs up. Excuse me. Stirring up my words already. A like and a thumbs up on this video if you enjoy any of this content. Uh, really helpful for the channel. Also, feel free to use the comment section to leave a comment, leave a suggestion. Like I say, you know, write a love poem to Scooby-Doo. Ask a question, start a conversation, it's all good. Just stop in and say hello. Hey, say, hey, Dread, I like the content, thanks. Whatever, hey, I'll take any encouragement I can get. I'm a small channel, just starting out, and I'm struggling to survive in a big, big world out there, people. So help me out any way you can. If you're not a subscriber to the channel, please consider becoming one. It helps you out, and it certainly helps me out. And don't forget, most of all, likes and views, people. Likes and views, please. And thank you. Appreciate all of you who support me in any way you can. It is much appreciated. You've got the Dreadster's heart, which is actually not on that side of his chest. Wait a second. I'll, I'll switch. Switching hands. It's over here. Oh, my God. I am not an anatomy major. Ladies, come on by. Help me play doctor. I'll get better. All right. So this is uh, day two on the uh, Wack Nation server. Uh, I know, Wack Nation. It's, it's, it's pretty fabulous out here. I, I know, really it is. It's uh, thank you people of Wack Nation. Thank you, thank you. So glad to be a part of you. So glad to be, wait, not that kind of a part of you. That's weird. So glad to be a part of Wack Nation and uh, so happy to be on the server, trying it out. It's, uh, it's a blast so far. Uh, it's definitely different with all the different mods. It's different with all the different stuff on the map that I stumble across. And I'm like, what the frig is that? And where did that come from? And what and how? And and I'm going to see many, many more amazing things. And I thank you all from the, again, from the bottom of my heart, which is over on this side. I'm learning. I'm learning, ladies. I'm learning. I'm not even going to comment anymore on this. Okay. <laughs> So, uh, what are we doing here? This is going to be a, uh, well, as you would already know when you clicked on this, it's going to be a shorter video. This is just day two on the Wag Nation here. I, I've been doing some some stuff. I, I kind of came into the server and uh, did a little scouting around, and uh, I was like, I don't, I don't like this area for a base, which is why I, I no longer have a base here. Which is why I, uh, I, I destroyed all my blocks for these last two and the stuff I've got in the box here. I'm taking those with me now, and I'm going to... Uh, I'm going to show you, see, we're right down here. Well, we moved our base over to here. That's where I decided to build, and it fit a little better. The landscape was a little better. Uh, it went with, you know, more or less the plans I already had. It still worked. Um, my base is going to take a long time to make. I understand that. Uh, I'm just trying to get foundations done so I can get more work pitches and things going. I'm still pretty early in the game here. Like I say, day two, I'm at level 20. And uh, we are getting out of this shite box. Can I say shite box? I just did, so I guess so. Uh, I didn't, yeah, I didn't. This area I thought was gonna be good, but it just it didn't work for, for what I wanted to do. Might be good for somebody else though. Might be. Alrighty, I'm just going to uh, go over here and attack some of these trees with my uh, pickaxe before we leave. Cause I got inventory space, so. Nice, we'll take advantage of that. Come on, give me some resin. I need some resin. There's some resin, thank you. Why do I need resin? Because I'm doing some building with some northern timber, and I need resin for northern timber. up my axe when I get back. It's okay. All right. Let's, uh, let's, 
I got a billion of these saplings and I don't even know what they're used for. Uh, really don't need more seeds right now. It's just weighing me down. I don't want the dry plant material because I don't know what it's for. Um, why do I have sand? Okay, I got to keep the sandstone foundations. I really shouldn't even have those on me, though. Bye. All right, let's grab some rock here, too. Because you know how Dread likes to rock. Here at Miss Valley Gaming, we rock hard. Soft rock is weird. Yeah, I knew that was gonna happen. All right, we're out of here. <laughs> That's the cider for us. Let's go, people. I will run you over to uh, where my uh, new base location is. As soon as I grab some water and something to eat. Awesome. Let's go. Get to do some desert running. Great. Love the desert. Love the dry heat. I don't know. Supposedly dry heat's great. I don't know. I live in a place with moist heat and it sucks. I mean, no. I mean, the place I live is like... Okay, not like the actual apartment I live in, but I mean, the, the place I, I live geographically is actually very, very good. Uh, I am in Canada. I am in a very temperate valley. Is that the right words for it? It's a valley that uh, has been known over the years for, like, uh, produce and, you know, grapes and wine and that kind of stuff. But it's it's gradually getting more and more dry and more and more deserty. It's not dry enough, though. I mean, we're, we're far north. We're not, we're not actually dry conditions. Uh, there are large, very large lakes in the valleys here the, in the area where I'm at. So uh, lots of lakes and one extremely bi a large, uh, deep lake. And that helps keep everything very, very warm. You've never heard of the Okanagan Valley in Canada. There is also one, I believe, in Washington State, I believe. Spell it differently, though. But the Okanagan Valley in Canada is a uh, retirement destination. And it's where, like, uh, rich people want to come and have summer homes. Uh, a lot of athletes, especially hockey players and stuff, have homes here and come here in the summertime. Uh, mind you, they all live on the lake in their multi-million dollar beach houses. I don't see them, but... Uh, yeah, very desirable place to be. Uh, can be a very expensive place to live, though, unfortunately. Unfortunately, I say unfortunately because I don't have money. What is money, anyways? I don't know. So we're uh, we're just running over here. We're uh, we're running, running, running. Because that's what we do. We're a running fool. Just a run machine. get to run through the desert. It's great. I'm kind of glad I don't have to do this anymore. Um, the one thing is the area I've picked doesn't have a lot of rock. So, that sucks. Get bring another pick. So, I should probably grab some more rock since I still have some inventory space. Look at all these nice runes and stuff out here. Oh, that one's got a nasty critter in it. Oh, it's that flying bat creature. I don't know if there's any, any inhabitants of these. I'm not sure. I might, Like I say, I might check them out later on. Why not? Something to do, right? Something to do. So... I'm just concentrating on my rocks. Just give me those rocks! Give it to me! That's about it. It's pretty cool here. I'm like, oh, I can climb up there and explore. And then I'm like, no, there's a reason I can't climb up there and explore. I'll show you in a bit. Some stamina back so I can do the climb. Climb down in here. Oh, I am a climbing. Uh, let's see if this works. Yeah, stop complaining. Just climb down there, Biatch. It's my avatar. It's like I'm calling myself that, right? Yeah, come on in. You said door frame. 
So this little area here is going to be the part that is a uh, northern timber. And uh, it's going to go up into a large two-story, uh, two-floor, not two-story, but two-floor? No, two-story, I don't know, whichever it is. Anyways, I'm going to have a second floor to it. Uh, each floor will probably be two blocks high, though. And a nice big peaked roof on it. Uh, over here, which hasn't been built in yet, will just be a little open patio. And then this area here that's up uh, too high here. Right, anyways. Uh, this is all going to be uh, a secondary building. You can have like a wheel of pain and stuff, and you know, all that good stuff. Probably a lot of uh, crafting benches and stuff in here, maybe on a second floor. Um, I did have this going out here because I was going to build going this way. But I think I'm just going to take this line right out here. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to put my uh, animal pen and my stables and probably my uh, altar to set, whatever it's called, uh, back in this area. Because it's really, you can't you can't really get to it. I mean, you can't get to it because you can't, you're, you're not going to be able to get by my, my house over here. It's gonna go like basically right up to the cliff wall, so uh, yeah, you're not you're not getting by through this way. Well, maybe you are. I could put a little little fence there to stop you, though. So the only way then to get into this area would be around back. This is all cliffs and stuff, and you'd have to go back this way and around my base. So by the way, the reason I can't climb up here and investigate is because hey, there's a green wall of death going through that. Too bad, because there's some cool-looking stuff up there, but I don't think I can get to it. There's a green wall of death right there. Cool, eh? Oh, and I got, uh, you know... And this here, I'm going to have to move it, because I'm supposed to be making this higher. But this over here, and I get some... Uh, fire and some fire pits. Oh, uh, fire pits. Fire and... <laughs> These aren't fire pits. <laughs> don't light my wooden boxes on fire. Some wooden boxes, yes, and uh, yeah, it's uh, it's going pretty well. I mean, it's it's a slow go. I'm I'm not fast at this game. I'm not. I mean, for the long haul, or until I get bored, which is usually what happens first. But I, you know, hopefully on this server, I'm not going to be getting bored. The thought, maybe I won't get bored here. Maybe I won't. So everybody on the server, come on by and raid me. No, I'm kidding. No, I don't think I don't think there is any raiding on the server, is there? I, I don't think there is. I'm like carrying my turban around still. And I don't know. Okay, let's put that over there. Oh, I got like that out of my uh, box. Oh, I'm an idiot. I'm not actually carrying it around. Okay. At least I wasn't until I emptied the box out. Well, I understand. I understand. Somebody does. Um, that's not fair. I am not over encumbered. I am the opposite of over encumbered. I am non over encumbered. Where do I still. I don't there, let's put, uh, let's put that there. So yeah, this is what the base is going to look like, except uh, all the stuff that's sandstone right now is only sandstone temporarily. I just uh, bought myself the, uh, I should say the perk, the feet for um, stone brick. I actually want all this to be stone brick. So I wonder what it's going to cost me like to upgrade. Eh, see, I'm going to have to have uh, benches and stuff to get that done. So I'm probably going to fill a lot of just the foundation in here. Maybe not all of it, but some of it with the with the uh, sandstone, and then I'll work on my benches and getting my uh, the stuff I need to upgrade all that all of this stuff to uh, to stone brick. I like that a much better. Um, I I usually build with flotsam. Ever since I uh, the Alcipta came out and I got into it, I really like the flotsam set. It's pretty rugged, uh, but it's neat. I really enjoy it. But I decided to use Northern Timber this time. I've, I've worked with this as well. The only thing I don't like about Northern Timber, like, I really like the foundations and stuff. I'm not really that fond of, like, the doorways and the windows. Even the walls are just okay. They're not great. 
foundations look amazing, though. Really, really love them. But yeah, the door frames and the window frames and stuff are just kind of they're kind of odd. I wish they, uh, I wish they would whoever did that would upgrade it and either come up with a different set that's very like it but slightly different, or just make some changes to it until it just looks a little better. Like I don't like the door frame where the the actual door part of it is like uh, off center. And same thing with the window things, right? They're they're off centered in the piece, and it's just it's strange. It should be middle. It really should be middle, I think. Anybody agree with me? Anybody not agree? Go up yourself. No, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. But you can go up yourself if you want. Send me photos. No, no, don't listen to me. Never, never listen to dread. Because I've got one hand in my pocket and the other one's in my other pocket. That's weird. I don't even have any pockets. Oh, they're just both in my pants. That is so strange and yet so hot. Anyways, um, there are uh, a couple of camps around here. I took a look at one of the uh, one of the interactive maps on online, so I know there's some camps. There's some spawn points for antelope and stuff out here. Um, I think there's at least three camps that I can go whack people from. <laughs> whack people from. Whack them over the head with the trunchy on. Get, come, come, taste my trunchy on, biatch. And uh, yeah. You can throw them on the wheel and go to the fireplace and get a fire there and get some popcorn going and just sit in my easy chair and watch them sweat away in the wheel. Apparently you can actually see the people on the wheel now, I've heard. They don't actually have your person you stuck in the wheel be on the wheel. That's pretty awesome. I'm like thinking to myself, do I have any mods that makes the people on the wheel make it? No, I don't. Okay. I think I've had those mods before, but I don't now. So yeah, that's safe. I gotta be careful. I do have to be careful with my settings, because I know what my settings are, and I do have to be careful. That's all I'm saying. <laughs> hey, to each their own, and my own is awesome. So yeah, I'm a, I'm enjoying things here on the uh, on the Wack Nation server. It is pretty cool. It is pretty different. Um, I'm still, I mean, honestly, do I, do I actually know what all the different uh, mods and stuff do? I really don't. Um, not at all. That's okay, though. That's okay. Oh, I was going over here. Uh, I wanted to go down here and fix my iron pickup. Um, I am going to be farther o far, 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 farther away. Yes, farther. That's the word. Um, from getting more iron ore in my usual spot. So that either it's going to be a longer trip or I'm going to have to find a, a closer place. I am uh, on the map further east than I would normally go for a starting point. Right, I, I would normally go somewhere along here, although I have started out like here before, but a long time ago. Always single player, my dear. But yeah, so being over in this area is kind of, I have not explored like this side of the river, anything from about here over. I, I haven't even touched before ever. So, there's a sense of newness to this, which is good. I, I wanted I wanted a new challenge. I wanted new things to see. Uh, I know there's some kind of ruins right over here that I'll go check out at some point, too. By my luck, probably inhabited. All right. So just looking at the map and stuff, like, I don't know what all this stuff on the map is. I got to admit. Like, like, why do I see all these groupings of, lots of times groupings, of, of religious buildings. Is that because that's someone's base and for whatever reason it just shows up on the map when when there's religious stuff built? Is that just a setting? Um, or, or what's going on? Now what are with these outposts with no owner? Does that mean it used to belong to somebody? No. Is that something that Wack or Stormy or whoever is in charge of the server has dropped into the server? And that's, that's just... That's why it's there. And are these safe places to go or not? I mean, are you going to get, I mean, I was over here before looking at this place. If I went in, was I going to get him attacked? Like, the things I don't know. It's a bounty board over here. I think that's a new thing, like the server. It's something for the server, not otherwise, right? Like, what is like, so it's an altar. Okay, yeah. These are all religious stuff. I really, I really don't know what all this stuff is, but I hope to be here long enough to find out. Be interesting. 
So, uh, feel free to drop by. I mean, there's not much here, people, and I know most of you on the server are probably in uh, other areas. You're probably not in noob areas. Ooh, spooky eyes. But, uh, yeah. Feel free to drop in and drop a dookie on my lawn and light it on fire, run off laughing. I don't know. Uh, I'm imagining that... Yeah, I don't know. Is there voice chat even? And if there is, is there voice chat between clans? I I have I don't even know. I, I, questions I should probably be asking, but I mean, same time I'm just here to play. I don't know, man. I don't want to get too technical. I just want to have fun, just like a girl, man. Girls just want to have fun, and I just want to have fun with girls. But then I end up marrying them, and then they divorce me. So yeah, it doesn't go well. I mean, it goes well up to that point. Well, up till sometime before that point, but... Oh, I'd love women, and I know he does, and I know I do too. I can't keep them happy very long, but uh, I love them. Green Wall of Death, you suck. I'm oh, sorry, shouldn't have done that, but I did it anyways. No filter. All right, folks, Um, I'm calling this an episode. It is what it is. It's just a... Uh, a fill in to let you know what I'm doing. I uh, honestly have no plans to officially uh, run this as a series as, as such. I don't I don't think I'm going to be like this point anyways. I'm not planning on setting up a, a date or a time for this. I'm just going to release these from time to time here and there. So, you know, like this, they may come out uh, back to back days. Other times or whatever, they may just, yeah. They may not. This is Dread from Miss Valley Gaming. Did you like what you just saw? Did you like what you just heard? If so, please leave a like down below. And if you aren't a current subscriber, hit that big old red subscribe button down there. Without your likes, your comments, and your subscriptions, this channel cannot survive. So please continue to do your part to help Miss Valley Gaming grow. Thank you so much, and now, back to the action. They, you know, they just may not see them for a while, and I may, I may run around in the game and do some stuff, and then not record it, and then record something. So, uh, who knows? Who really freaking knows? Not I. Uh, by the way, I think this is going to come out on uh, May the fourth, I believe. So, uh, may the fourth be with you. Happy Star Wars Day, everybody. Hopefully, some good news came out for all you Star Wars fans. That includes myself. Uh, goodness knows, uh, no matter how you may or may not feel about Disney and Disney owning uh, Star Wars and Lucasfilm, um, I know that uh, on May the 4th, I plan on... Uh, what do I plan on? Well, probably I'm going to uh, go down to my, my George Lucas altar and offer a bunch of sacrifices to George Lucas. And uh, after that, I'm probably going to... Uh, I'll go Carrie Fisher in the, in the original trilogy time and time again as I watch all three of those. I might do something like that. Yeah, because Carrie Fisher was hot in the original series. I mean, really, original trilogy, she really, really was. I mean, she was a phenomenal actress, great character. She added so much to the film in many, many ways. But she was a nice piece of eye candy as well. I just want to say that. I mean... There's no question that uh, many young boys and young men uh, probably were attracted to that that film by Carrie Fisher. And uh, I'm sure that they, uh, most of them, came away loving more than just Carrie's performance and her, her looks. But, uh, yeah. I don't think Star Wars is what it is without Carrie Fisher. I just don't think it was, I don't think it'd be anything. I think it'd be a, a big wash up nothing. I'm sorry, George. I don't, I don't mean to insult your, uh, your films that's not what i mean they're 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 great films but they needed the right actress for them too and carrie was definitely uh, the right actor for her part and uh yeah rest in peace carrie fisher all right people once again may the, may the fourth be with you happy star wars day and uh yeah may all your crazy be in good fun from the whack nation server this is Miss Valley Gaming. My name is Dread. We'll catch up next time. Bye bye, all. Bye, Whack. Because gaming should be fun.
let's get a little bit crazy. Crazy. Good. Fun. 